Alright everyone, welcome back. And Demic here, we are back with another World of Tanks video. Today we are playing the T-54E1 on the map Serene Coast. And as a heavy tank, we are going to head to the right side there, like all good heavy tanks do. Although, recently I've also seen a lot of heavies go to the other side of the map on the, the one line. But... Most of the heavies are going this way, and I'm the top tier, top tank on this team, so... We're gonna try to take advantage of the, the terrain here and peek around in 1v1 situations and, and outclip them with the clip gun. They're all clumped up on the other side of this hill. I know more tanks are coming, most likely, so I'm not gonna go too far. This defender is quite aggressive, but I'll let him move up and spot everyone. Now we can see there were there's a, another tank coming. I don't want to have to deal with that 101 P's heavy armor. So I'm gonna try to go around the other side now. Get up nice and close. This enemy tank, he must have been very um, confident in his armor and his double guns, but he ends up not getting exactly what he wanted. I don't pen the last shot. Got three out of four, but then allies help clean him up. And I don't know why, but I didn't have any consumables this battle, so my my driver is down for the rest of the battle. So we're just gonna have to make the best of it and do what we can. While I'm on reload, I'm just gonna hide behind this boulder and take a quick look just to see if anyone else was unspotted there. But now I'm just waiting for Reload to go back in and do some more damage. So the 101 p just shot, so I'm pretty comfortable going forward. And the Defender also just shot, so now I can come around all the way. Quickly jump into some lower, lower terrain here to get away from that VK's gun. Now I'm going to get nice and close. There's the Kanji Panzer, I believe it is. So I'm just going to come up. I don't think he has the gun depression to shoot me there. So I'm just going to empty my clip, attract him, and now let some of the other guys take the hits while I'm back on reload again. Took one shot there from the Kanji Panzer, but I'd take that shot over the VK's gun any day. It's about half the damage. Now all the heavies are going around that right side of this hill, so I'm gonna come the other direction and try to play medium tank here and flank. Still on reload, so I'm gonna wait here just a bit until I'm back up and then peek over. I didn't want that Progetto to spot me, but now he's been spotted again, so now I can move up. There's not a whole lot of action going on here. So I'll just get around this boulder and off we go. There it is. I apologize for that error there. I'm not sure what why that happened. Now we're on reload again. I debated going back when I heard that our base was being captured, but then I saw that the turtle was still there, so I felt comfortable moving up on the enemy base instead. And of course I missed that shot on the light. Three shots left though. So we're just gonna run through the village and try to come up on the front side. We have tanks coming from the left and the right, but there's not really a whole lot happening from the front, so I'm gonna try to do what I can there. See this leopard coming up, auto aim and take him out. And at this point, their base is basically taken care of. You just have one arty and two light tanks left, so it's a matter of going hunting now. I'm gonna go back on reload now, because there's nothing happening here and I have a long ways to go to find anything. So I believe that WZ is just making circles around the turtle and eventually takes him out. Yeah, there it is. So I'll just mosey my way on back. But I'm going to come around the front. I think if I had come around the back, that might have been smarter, but it also would have taken longer.
now that I'm spotted, I felt pretty comfortable tanking a few shots. I know he's probably just sitting in the back with his camo up, up and he just wants to get as many shots in as he can before I, before I spot him. Especially now that he missed that first shot, he hit the tank in front of me. So now I can just tank some shots and spot him. There we go. And now I auto-aim and just empty my clip into him. There it is. 4.6k damage, 3 kills. That is it for this video. I don't have the damage charts today. But uh, feel free to leave a like and subscribe and leave a comment. Thanks for watching and we will see you all in the next one.